I'm going to show you how to apply Riva, the rapid entire body assessment technique to evaluate some work tasks. In this job, this person is working as an auto detailer and then waxing this car. Um, so I have taken few representative posture of this job and then this is one of the posture that the person is spent about um, um fifty percent of the time and on this posture the person is spent about um let me get my pen so on posture one person is spent about fifty percent of the time that's what the problem says and then on this second posture uh, this individual is spending about thirty five percent time on this third posture is only fifteen percent time and I will show you one of the um, snapshot how to um, analyze the um, job using the um, Riva method. So I have this macro. Let me bring that. Uh, so many things running in my computer. Frozen. So I have this macro, um, I will upload this in the openeducator.com so you have access to this and I will use this example to show how it is a very simple if simple uh, tool. So if you look at the trunk again it's over 60% uh, uh, so the score will be about 4 uh, and then for the um, force, uh, this tools vibrate a lot. If you have used a waxing buffer, it do vibrate. So I'm gonna add just one because of that vibration. Coupling factor, it has a good handle, so I'll not add any factor to that. Then upper arm is, I would say, more than 90 degree. However, it is supported um, on this um, hood. So I would say that should be over um, 90 which is 4 and then minus 1 because of the support is so it actually eventually uh, 3 and then the neck is score because I would say it's a little bit extended so I would add 1 to that uh, lower arm is fine so we should not I'm not gonna add anything to it and then the leg is score which is which I also think fine um, wrist is fine I think there is nothing wrong with the wrist um, so yeah so this is the scores for um, for this particular posture and then I have analyzed all of these three posture and then um, so the way you calculate the final score is to have a push a score for first posture a score for second posture and third posture and the kind of time average them so this is actually seven So this is actually, I made a mistake in there. I don't know how six came there, probably. I, so that's 6.5, 6.5. So if you get the final score, use my pen, 6.5. And then um, this is the Riva recommendation. Where is my table? So here is the Riva recommendation. So if you get 6.5, now Ruler Riva has a different recommendation, different scores. So make sure you don't confuse that. Uh, Riva only goes from 1 to 7, Riva goes from 1 to 15. So in this case, we found 6.5. So we are in the medium risk level. So change is necessary. Um, so. Um, that's how you use the uh, Riva to evaluate job. Now both this ruler Riva, there is a automated software for this EMS processing software. So you really don't have to think about how many percentage of time a person is spending on what particular posture. If you have EMS processing software, it will give you the uh, snapshot for a continuous basis. So this score will be much better 
um, evaluation score for continuously evaluated task. Um, I'll probably explain that software. Uh, however, um, this is the behind the scene process that Reba or um, in the earlier video I have shown Rula uh, the way it works. And hopefully I'll also explain that software, how to use the image processing software to so that we don't have to count the percentage of time is spent on some time. This is kind of like a rough estimation. If we have some like over time, if we have every single snap, you know uh, posture we can analyze then we get a very good estimation of this number and our risk assessment will be much more precise but this will give you some idea of how Riva works